Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We are Tecton Home Construction. For those of you who are new to the channel, my name is Kendra and we are in the process of doing our very own custom home. Um, we are right now framing up interior walls upstairs. So we are almost done with framing, uh, making some really good project here, uh, progress here on the house. And I'll go up and show you here in a second um, how we are doing with our interior walls on the second floor. exterior sheathing. Um, as you can see right here, we have these big stacks of our Zip System R6 insulated panel that'll be going on the walls of the house. So I'll show you here in a minute what that looks like, but um, I've used this Zip System on projects with work before. It's a great product. Um, it's a system that the weather barrier um, on the house instead of using a typical house wrap is actually adhered directly to the structural sheathing and then this specific panel actually has foam adhered to the inside of that panel so um, what it'll do is it'll give us a layer of rigid insulation continuous all the way around the house um, which helps prevent thermal breaks where you normally have on a typical standard bat insulation typical sheathing on a house, you're gonna have um, all these thermal breaks wherever there's a stud because you're gonna have wood directly with wood. But this will allow us to have continuous insulation all the way around with no 
thermal breaks where you have studs. So it'll make us a lot more energy efficient. It'll help um, our energy bill, our HVAC system. And um, it's just a really great product. It's a lot easier to install in that we have far less steps. So instead of having, you know, putting up the sheathing, putting up the house wrap, putting up the rigid insulation in separate pieces, it's all in one panel. And so we just put up that one panel and nail it to the house and then we tape all the seams and we're good to go. So it's a pretty cool system. I definitely recommend using it. I'll show you here what it looks like. So this is our zip system, our sheathing, as you can see on the label. So we have 134 sheets. So you can see here, this is the one inch of rigid insulation. And this is the 7 16th inch panel that um, is required structurally. And um, I'll show you, I'll go around to the other side so you can see the vapor barrier, what that looks like on top of the panel. So it's almost an inch and a half thick. So it's pretty thick. Um, and it's gonna be a little difficult to install compared to just a regular 7 16th inch panel, but it's gonna save us a lot of time in our steps and be a really efficient system. So i um, really excited to use this on the house. Um, I think it's a great product. Um, and I think it's really the direction that the building industry is going because it makes a lot more sense with energy codes and efficiency and ease of install and um, just provides a much better weather barrier than traditional house wrap. So um, I'll show you if we walk around to this side of the stack, you can see over here, it's exposed a little bit here. This is green on top. So their 7 16th inch panels are um, green. So if you've ever seen a building with this green sheathing, that's a zip system uh, sheathing. And so this green um, shows the side that has the vapor barrier adhered directly to the OSB. Um, so once this is all on, this is the side that'll be facing out and we'll tape all the seams, fill any holes, uh, nail holes and get a really good weather barrier on the exterior of the house. So we also have um, for the roof, we're using the system as well. It's not the insulated panel, but um, it's a 5 8 inch panel. So it's a pretty thick panel just due to structural loads. We have to have um, that size of panel for our roof sheathing. So that panel is going to be more of a terracotta kind of rust colored um, on top and five eighths inch thick without the foam. So that one hasn't arrived yet, but we'll be using this same system on the roof as well.